I'm Shitan Ding. I come from China. In the past 12 years, I studied recording at minority traditional music. I went to China, all of minority area, different province like Xinjiang, Tibet, Guizhou, Guangxi, and uh, Yunnan, and also about uh, East uh, South Asia country like Vietnam, Laos, Cambodia, Thailand, also Indonesia. In the past 12 years, yes, I recording a lot. I also make one small uh, label to publish all my recording music. This uh, very simple music, like a uh, hands make. Also, some music uh, publishing house publish some my minority music in different countries, in France, in Germany, in Portugal, and England. Right now, I still uh, want recording more different countries' minorities' music. For example, my plan will go to the Black Sea, go around Black Sea, have six uh, countries. For me, it's really exciting things. I'm born from Xinjiang, west of China. In my hometown, I have a lot of uh, minority. I have more than 40 different minorities. Uh, mostly it's uh, Uyghur and also Hazak a lot. I really uh, like Hazak uh, traditional culture. In their uh, traditional music, they always use the very old uh, instrument called Sibuzi, but it's like flute, have three holes. Uh, when I recording, when the musician play this instrument, I get a lot of uh, imagine. I feel the wind always uh, going over their area. The river, big grass, animals, and also like uh, the local people, their faith. For them, it's four things uh, so important in their life. Grass, animals, and family, and uh, uh, music. This also touch uh, my heart. The other I'm really like uh, one instrument is uh, Ma Tou Qing. It's from Mongolia. You know, when this instrument study, play, uh, I, I feeling I get so peace, very soft, uh, feeling soft heart. This instrument also can talking with animals. They also understand. I think I went to many different uh, countries and uh, different minority villages. Of course, it's so far and uh, their life very poor. Yeah, food and the house we live are not comfortable, but I don't care so much. In Laos, I remember 2010, I went to there to recording. There in the July, have rainy season. The road in every all of country is not good. So we uh, went to the north of uh, the country, all of mountains, and uh, some somewhere uh, have earth falling down. So it's very dangerous. Some people die. I'm in the bars, uh, staying 40 hours, cannot move, and no food. Sometimes uh, some things happened, but for me, it's most difficult things, like I traveling so far to some villages. When I, I arrived there, I realized they're totally lost uh, old music. For, for me, this is really sad. From 2006, to 2016, the 10 years, uh, I just uh, recalling by myself. Uh, of course, I have the other job. Like I'm a writer, I publish my book. I writing many articles for different magazines. Before when I recording, uh, I'm journalist. I also sometimes doing different things to make money. But all of recording, traveling, spend money uh, all by myself. From 2006 to now, I make uh, like 200 CDs from different uh, countries and different minorities. Just two years before, one Chinese uh, big music publishing house called Stars, they find me, they try with me together. They want also in the future to publish some minorities. Some like my idea to maybe give some my music to the museum, to make the traditional music museum in internet more and more young people to know the old culture, to know different uh, music culture. Every time I make uh, one or two times uh, recording plan for each year, like every time, like 100 days, uh, I get money from them. This is good, so I can 
spend more and more time in future. I'm not really remember, but nine or ten times I, I come to Berlin from 2014 to now, nearly like 30 uh, percent time per year. I, I I'm here. I'm very interested about the war, like here at Mauer Park, because I'm very interested in the, the line or the bird to make a totally different uh, or can change the different uh, culture, different uh, system, can really make people have different thinking, different mind. So even I wrote an article about bowling war, I, I also interested in uh, some local people asking them their moment about the, uh, the war. Beginning of 1990s, how they mix different culture mix. And I live here uh, nearly uh, here. And I saw here also, right now, the people from different uh, countries, really the culture also mix. Here also every year is change in Berlin. And now I'm feeling here is more open, actually for uh, different uh, artists. It's good uh, to, to show Berlin is more open. I think the government also like to invite different uh, culture people, artists, musicians, to make uh, Berlin more life, more energy. One New Zealand documentary movie director, in 2010, he made one documentary movie for us because I also have one small label called King Kong. He made a documentary movie about our recording. This movie called Small Pass Music, so you can try to find it in the internet. We still produce more and more CDs. We have one website called King Kong, you can visit. And next month, I hope uh, yeah, more and more people come to Aku to listen to my music.